Hey folks, quick video, Bikes with Brad. I had somebody ask me about the instructions or the process steps of how to get your disc road, or cross bike in this case, the boon, uh, onto a kicker trainer. So that's what the pictures and uh, the videos after this are for. So um, just need somewhere to upload it with audio. Hopefully it helps somebody. He said rotate it backwards that's what he's talking about because it makes more clearance to pull the cassette and the wheel out of there all right i'm trying to video this in uh, a confined space here so hopefully it comes out but line the chain up on the smallest cog on the cassette okay to match what you did before and then you can ease the bike over so that lines up right there. And that means that you've also got it lined up on this side as well. Oh, one other thing. So the chain doesn't, like it don't get out of bent, bent out of shape if it's not on the smallest, like it's it's fine. It'll, it will put itself in the right place once you get everything together, pedal it, it'll, it'll fall in the right spot. And then the racks will back in, and this side over here, you just you may have to move the bike around to find it. There it goes. And, there, and then the thing about the axles in, keeping it from stripping the threads, just go easy. You might have to like wiggle the bike and adjust it and things to make sure everything's lined up right. But once it gets started, it just goes in like any other bolt. Uh, you can use the torque wrench you mentioned. You know, just give it a, uh, a good tug. You don't, you shouldn't have to need a long tool to get that on or off. Uh, just like, you see how short this little thing is? Um, like I give it a good oomph and then that's it. I can, I'm not trying to break anything by doing this and the bike's not gonna go anywhere. Then you can give it, it's gonna be hard to pedal cause you're in your hardest gear, but that's it. Now you're bolted in, uh, lights are on. It thinks I'm trying to do something and uh, yeah, good to go. Oh, don't ever, ever, ever put your fingers anywhere near any of this stuff, okay? Because this flywheel and this flywheel are heavy, and if you're messing around and you spin it backwards and get something stuck in there, it will hurt the whole time, I promise. Love you, bye.